Today I'm in the lucky position that all I have to do is say nice things about Laura. And I think most people here would know that daughters have a very special place in their dad's heart, and Laura and I are no exception. Laura knows I would do anything for her. In other words, she has me wrapped around her little finger. <laughs> and she's been playing me since she could talk, and I suppose, I hope that'll never change. <laughs> Laura's been a joy in her life since the day she was born. She started smiling at six weeks and has continued to do so ever since. She has an infectious love of life and boundless energy. She laughs out loud, very loud, <laughs> and, and cries easily. That's because she's a sensitive soul. She's a pleaser. She loves to make people happy. I suppose, given the day that's in it, was a, a certain poignancy attached to the occasion. But I know that, you know, I have to, I have to think, you know, really and truly that Phil mightn't be here, but uh, in person, but to witness the proceedings, but she's certainly here and uh, um, <clears throat> is that this day uh, will radiate like a ray of sunshine from the heavens throughout the lives of Laura and Tim. It was a long, happy and fruitful day for them both. In words oft spoken by that great poet, Reggie, my brother, <laughs> um, and with apologies to the bard, I wish you both a heart to love, and in that heart, courage to make love known. Oh Lord, you know, uh, <clears throat> I, I, I think today, you know, when we're here gathered and as Father Chamber says at Mass, um, absent friends, people who couldn't be here, people who have passed on, and you know, that's in its place. But for us here today, the crack starts now when this gets on. <laughs> I don't know if you're aware of this, but you were, were not the first man in her life. <laughs> that was actually Ronan Keating. Amen, I'm impressed with how like, nice you're being. <laughs> He's not a PGA type of guy, yeah.
introduce to you the lovely lady here. It's a new, improved Miss Laura Walsh. <laughs> Um, but seriously, Laura, I cannot believe yesterday you were my girlfriend and today I have the pleasure of calling you my wife. I declare you husband and wife.